I mean, you know what, man? Um, music ain't got no color, man. I mean, I don't care, man. Where are you from, man? If it's good, it's good. Yeah. If Mickey Mouse produced it, man, <laughs> if it if he produced a good record, yeah, you got to give it up. Yeah. Because you will want somebody to do the same for you. Yeah. You know what I mean? You don't want nobody hating on your record, man. If it's a good record, eh, I'm like for some for some reason, man. Like, yeah, it's okay. And they know that it's good. You know what I mean? Mm. But they hating on it though. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like you don't want anybody like that. So I'm like, man. It ain't got no music. That, that's what's beautiful about music, man. It's like, it's about the record. It ain't about, it ain't really about like who did it. It's mm. about the record and how it make you feel, man. Yeah. You know what I mean? Music make you feel a certain way, man. If you really think about it, music marks time, man. You can, you can remember, man, like, like when Love's Holiday came on, you can remember where you was at. Mm. You could be like, dang, I was at the fair with my girl, man. And, when I first heard that record yeah. or when you hear a record that you really, really like, you'd be like, you'd be telling your friends like, Hey man, I was doing this when I first heard that, man. Yeah, I was doing yeah. that. I was yeah. on the highway doing this and it came on and I was yeah, like, yeah. you know what I mean? Yeah. When it's I hear like, Rhythm, Rhythm of the Night, I remember being back in boarding school and it just, if I hear it right now, it just takes me back to 1983 being in, in, in boarding school and, and just yeah, being upset about being that I had to live in school. <laughs> but you, but it, it is but true. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, you, but you know, man, that's how music is, man. That's yeah. what's so beautiful about it, man. It's like it marks time and space yeah. for us, man. And um, if it make you feel good, you ain't thinking about how what color they are, man. Yeah, no, it's true. And I, I think, but John, when I interviewed John Bead like just last week, he said when he started off, people were making, you know. Did have you know they were making you know he had some snart comments within the industry. It but it took a while for other people to recognize him, like Tupac and stuff. That actually, people then um, said, okay, you know we're going to give him some respect because he's not just kind of come in and like like a George Michael and stuff. But you know I think most of us as fans, we appreciate him. We appreciate Tina Marie. Which you know, by the way, man, you just said you just said a mouthful. George Michael was mm. crazy. Think yeah. about some of the records he was doing, man. Yeah, yeah. Um, what was that one? I'm never gonna dance again. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Careless Whispers. He did. Um, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We did that over on Tamia, man. Ah. Oh. Go look for it, man. Go look on the internet, man. You on YouTube, you'll find it. We did that over on Tamia. I love, man. Cause, man, I re again, I remember. When I was in high school, when that came out, mm -hmm. I was like, who is this, man? Yeah. Golly. You know what I'm saying? Um, the Tom Tom Club, man. Um, time. Time won't give me time, all that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? It's like, yeah. Um, I don't know, man. Uh, yeah. I mean, yeah. He, yeah, I, yeah. I, you know yeah, what I'm saying, man? That, that stuff ain't got no color on it, man. Yeah. It's just good records, man. Yeah, no, that's it's true. It's true. I mean, people... You know, people don't see the color of Tina Marie, but they just saw the talent. Just an she was unbelievable. Dope. She yeah. was dope too, man. Yeah, Tina Marie, <laughs> Square Biz, <laughs> and then uh, Portuguese Love. Remember that? Mm. Yeah, man. Yeah. Oh my goodness. She just had so oh, much. Ma <laughs> and then Magic too. Remember that? It must be magic because it feels so good to me, mm. man. She was doing something, man. <laughs> And and it's good too that we don't you know because I think sometimes we you 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 can become territorial but when you can't deny talent, and that's what you yeah, just hope okay. that you don't deny talent. What well, as we leave, what's your top five Tim and Bob songs? So which would be which if you had five, okay? Do you want five or ten that would make your top five or ten Tim and Bob productions that you know? And it can't be just because you know this was the biggest hit, but the ones that you really were passionate about, even if it didn't hit as hard. Let me see. They don't know. <laughs> is it they because don't know. it became a big hit? Or is it there something? It just be having to become a big hit, but they don't know, man. When I hear that, I'm like, I wouldn't change nothing about that record. I, I would Because there's a lot of records that I did that I'd be like, dang, man, why did I put that snare up so high? Why did I do the <laughs> kick like that? How come I didn't lower the backgrounds, man, when I mixed it, man? Like, how come? You know what I mean? It's a lot okay. of stuff that I wish I would have did over, you know what I mean? But, um, they don't know. I wouldn't change a thing about that one. 
missing you. I wouldn't change a thing. So into you. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, let me see. Let me think. Um, uh, it's a group that we did called Jersey Ave. You remember? Have you ever heard of them? No. Hey man, look them up. Jersey Avenue, man. Them boys. Avenue, was, okay. Hey, them boys were so dope, man. It's a record called uh, "I'll Be Right There." We did. We had just did. We had just did. Uh, well, no, I take that back. We just. We didn't just do it, but it just went number one. They don't know it. So when they came in, as soon as they came in the studio, they was like, hey, man, give us a record. The same simple as they don't know. <laughs> so me and Bob was like, all right, man, let's think of they don't know. Let's just put it in a different key. You know what I mean? Um, but we did a song called I'll Be Right There. Remember that, man. Go look it up on okay. YouTube. That's okay. a dope record, man. Then uh, I was just listening to... What what I did uh what I did on um me and Bob did um on a uh, Ron Isley man I want that that's another one okay um and then uh let me see uh let me see what uh, and then um uh, Earth Wind and Fire too um the uh the love the way you hold me yeah that's the name of it okay that's another one um. Man, we did a lot. Man, we did a lot of stuff. That um, I gotta have it from a, this, this group called Illusions. Look that up. It's a girl group called Illusions, man. Okay. And then it's a lot of stuff that I did. We did that didn't come out, man. I'm like, God. <laughs> so nothing. Man, from you boys know what? To we men. probably <laughs> did more. We probably did more stuff that didn't come out that came out. Wow. But you can still. Do you still own those tracks that you can re? Yeah, re I got them. Yep, I got okay. all of them, man. Okay. I got all this stuff. I mean, if I if I press play on Bob, he'll be like, "Man, I remember that, man." <laughs> man, I got look. I got a whole album on one twelve. I got an album on Mary J. Tamia. I got a whole album on Tamia. Wow! Right now, that if I put out, everybody be like, "Is this this a brand new album from Tamia?" Wow! Because we did so many records with her that didn't make okay. it, man. Okay, okay, okay. So I just kept them. Wow. You know what I mean? Um, let me see. Usher, Usher the same way. We did a lot of records on him that didn't make it. Wow. Um, one I said 112 already. Um, yeah, but, well. wow. I didn't really, yeah. Because Beyonce, there's so many records we did on them, it don't make no sense, man. Wow. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being a part of Halftime Chat. Please remember to subscribe, share, and comment. But most importantly, why don't you become a member of Halftime Chat? We've got amazing videos, amazing perks, and um, being able to support the channel. But anyway, thanks for watching. Take care. I never participated in that category. Hey, then somewhere in between. Or even loving us, on which I didn't miss. I'm not sure what was it like growing up. Yeah. I mean, I was, I, I love, I love all different jobs.